Hey guys, how's it going? I just wanted to make a quick video and this is actually going to be the first one where I actually make a story that actually happened to me. So uh, yeah, not really to me, but I experienced it. But yeah, grab some popcorn, sit back and relax because this is a crazy one. This actually happened last week and I'm still waiting to see where this will go. So I take a class called Coast Guard JROTC, right? And and Friday is our physical, is our physical training day. So on this specific day, we were, we were playing, I think it was baseball or something. And afterwards, we were all just about to go back, stuff like that, just, yeah. And my friend group, I, 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 have, a, I have a really good choice of friends, like bless their hearts, but uh, they were, they were, so they were trying to deadlift each other. And one of them actually dropped one of my friends. I'm gonna leave him out of this video, like his name and stuff, because like privacy. And at first we thought he was completely fine. Like he, he was just like kind of pissed. And he was walking back, but then he, like, complained about being dizzy and shit. And then he started, like, fell over a little bit and was, like, laying on the floor, stuff like that. And he was just completely out of it. Nobody knew this was happening, so everybody left except for me and uh, a few of my friends. They tried to help him up, and he was able to walk for a little bit, but then he just started collapsing again, and that was just scary. At this point, I was assuming it was a pretty bad concussion because this is normal this is like normal for a concussion you're like fine and then you just you're just out of it i asked if he needed anything like water uh one of my friends got him an ice pack and placed it on his head the master chief who was the teacher there he he ran over and one was wondering what was going on stuff like that and i don't know what happened next because one because one of the people there told me to tell the buses not take off yet I started booking it. I literally just booked to the buses, like told them to not take off yet. And I just booked it back. And by the time I got back, um, everybody was gone except for except for an ambulance, a few medical officers, uh, police officers, and the master chief. And they asked me what I was doing there. I was just like asking if he was okay, what like if he was gonna be all right. The master chief like shook his head and said, no, I don't think so. And that just, that's just one fierce. I was like, completely out of it. I was just walking back to the buses and I was tearing up. You can't make fun of me, bro. That was absolutely horrifying. I, th I thought this guy was gonna die. They certainly made it out to make it sound like he was going to die. So that was just like, that was devastating, man. Later, he texted the group chat and confirmed that he was fine. It was just a major concussion. Just a major concussion. What the hell? He said that it was a major concussion and that he couldn't leave his house until... I'm not actually sure when, but... A lot of stuff has been spreading like rumors and other stuff like that. It's just stupid, man. That's the entire story so far. I'll keep you guys posted as this goes because this is pretty crazy so far. And honestly, my best wishes to him because like rumors suck, dude. Uh, I really do not want us to spread. Neither does anybody else. It's just crazy. But yeah, that was absolutely horrifying. Zero out of 10, I would not recommend because that was... That was act that was scary. But yeah, I'll keep you guys posted on what happens and I'm gonna try to make videos more often on past events that have happened that have been crazy. Coming up, this kid wants to fight me. Which is exciting. But yeah, I'll see you guys later. I'm gonna head out now because I really need to go to bed. I will see you all later. Peace.